Hi, I'm Tasman Opley, cosmetic chemist and trainee here at the Institute of Personal Care Science. And today I'm going to show you how to make a glass skin serum. Now, the point of our glass skin serum is we want our skin to look really nice and bright and shiny, almost like glass. Um, so we want to add things in there that are going to obviously brighten the complexion and obviously make the skin really shine, so to speak. Now let me show you how to put it together. Okay, so starting off, I have my water phase here. Now to build my serum, I'm going to be making a slurry of xanthan gum in some propane gel. Now I don't want um, my serum to be sticky, so I have used propane gel instead of glycerin. So I'm going in with some of the distance xanthan. Xanthan is really good uh, for stability. It's a very common and wide known gum in the cosmetic industry and it's easy accessible as well. Now different grades of this um, can be less stringy, less tacky or sticky and more less gummy and the higher grades can also tend to give you um, quite a bit of clarity when it comes to gels so make them quite clear. Now you want to make sure you've got a nice smooth slurry here before putting it into your water phase otherwise you will get what we call fish eyes which is big blobs of gum that has not been hydrated properly. I'm just going to give that one a stir and you will see a nice uh, beautiful gel will start to form. It's quite clear also. Now I'm going to add a little bit of uh, Andy Roba oil. Now this is really good for, obviously for emolliency. It's going to add a lot a nice suppleness, um, soft feel to the skin and also add a little bit of shine. Now I'm going to be adding a little bit of hyaluronic acid here. This helps with hydration. Uh, hydration is another big key when it comes to glass skin. You want to make sure your skin's nice, uh, soft, supple and also hydrated. I'm also going to add in some hydraeus here. So this is by Givaden and this is a like a three in one uh, active. So it, it acts to rehydrate, restructure and um, repair the skin. My other sort of active I am going to be using here is um, some AHA free acids. Now this is really good for a few things, instant hydration, skin resurfacing, uh, chemical exfoliation and natural glow, deep cleanse, microbiome support and also really good for wrinkles. So again this is going to really improve our complexion here, it's going to give it a nice bright and natural glow, it's going to resurface skin so it's nice and smooth and shiny and you know it's also going to hydrate it as well so again it's going to mirror glass which is what we're going for now because this is an acid as well you want to make sure that you pick um, a relatively good really modifier that can stand those acidic environments as well or those highly active environments uh, next I'm going to be adding my preservative Uh, some a little bit of tocopherol because we did use a plant oil and I am going to just to be a bit over the top I am going to be adding some sparkly mica here just a small input this is going to get really really brighten and make our skin shine Now we're just going to check and adjust our pH because of the AHA acids we do want to keep the pH a little bit lower than usual so between 4 to 5. And as always we're just going to cover and leave this sit overnight make sure that all our actives including our acids stay stable and no signs of instability. Okay, and here is what our glass skin serum is looking like the next day. As you can see, it's remained very nice and stable. It's got really good viscosity. I see it's got that very slight sparkle in there that's just gonna you know, add a little bit extra onto our glass skin, really enhance it. As you can see, compared to my hand here, it's actually almost instantly brightened that up compared to this, which is looking quite dull. Now there's no stickiness or tackiness. It feels really nice and smooth and soft on the skin. And it's got also good spread as well. 
Well, there you go. That's how easy it is to create a glass skin serum to really brighten the appearance of your skin and keep it very hydrated. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up, leave any questions in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to receive notification on the rest of our videos. Happy formulating.